Hey guys, I hope that you're all doing well. Welcome back. Let's play some more of our Japanese Woko. Um, we're number three power in the world very soon to pass Russia. We were number two. It looks like the Ottomans. Okay, so we're we got passed by Russia. We're actually number four because Ottomans just haven't embraced tech yet. But that's all fine and dandy because we're going to end up making this one a big one. We're going to take these two islands. This guy here. Hello, if I can click it. Cape Verde. And then this guy here. Um, we're going to be able to get those. And then ideally we're going to take like one of these islands over here. And so somebody had mentioned the reason why this probably isn't happening is because I have my mission settings set to cautious. So let's go ahead and set them to bold. Will you do it? Do it. Hmm. Quite disappointing. Quite, quite disappointing. I want them to do it, but it's all good. We will sort it out. Maybe if we have them come down here, that'll work better. Ah, they're on their mission. Let's have you guys come down here. It might have something to... Oh, you've got to be kidding me. <laughs> I can't even be mad about that. That's fine. Um, let's go ahead and have you guys split off. Let's go with, like, something beefy. Like, 26. Just so there's no doubt about it. Who is the big dog here? Um, let's go ahead and have you guys privateering Sevilla again. Because we want to make sure we're bringing in as much money as we possibly can. Have these guys head down there. That's so funny. That Denmark just had this large, large army. Um, so where is my army at anyways? So we're down here taking attrition for no reason. Um, I want to use Bengal for war score. So let's see if we can... Where's my navy at? That was the thing. Where's my big navy at? Here they are. So I was going to see if I could get them to bring their armies back over here. But let's see if we could go ahead and boat bomb these guys. Hey, we won. Very good. Nice. We even stole some lights. So with that, let's go ahead and detach you guys. Let's have these guys explore the Caribbean coast and have them detach. There they go. Beautiful. They really were just a little scared. That's all. They just needed a little pick-me-up. Ah, crap. Um, slave ship captured. Ah, nice. Okay, so I don't think we're going to be sending our guys in there. Um, maybe we could... Ah, I was hoping to get another boat bomb off. That's fine. So we're losing a bunch of war score, unfortunately. Portugal has a lot of war enthusiasm. Now, I'm curious if... Um, Blockading them might be worth it for a few months. Let's go ahead and have them something like this. Blockade the crap out of them. We're going to take a big hit from that financially, but it shouldn't be an issue. And so, as far as extra things to take, I would like to take, like, this guy here. This would be a really good one, because this would get, let us get all of this. We would be able to get all of the Caribbean, basically. Um, and we could expand, we could explore based off of that as well, so. Let's go ahead and get you guys out here. And we're finishing up our plutocratic naval, I should say. Well, we need to get this Miltech. Oh my gosh. Um, okay. Well, that's not ideal. Let's see what's going on here. He's so young, too. That's so unfortunate. Okay, this guy is not so young, but... We'll make it work. Let's go ahead and have these guys. So, Bengal, really? Oh, Gulf of Cadiz, huh? Let's go ahead and teleport him over there. Ah, yeah, we're going to take a loss there. There's all heavies, unfortunately. We captured their flagship. Very nice. Okay, so we're actually totally winning this. Let's go ahead and have you guys go back out there. Um, where are they at? Oh, nice. Let's actually have you guys go ahead and explore the Caribbean Sea. How about that? Now, we're going to win this for, with heavy losses, but uh, 
We stole five heavies from them, so I guess is it really that big of a deal? That being said, though, we're gonna need to repair for a few months. Um, we're definitely gonna hold off. These, these uh, numbers are gonna be very important to us. So I would like to um, see if we can get this. This is not ideal. Though I feel like our lights are gonna still stomp them. Plus we have our, yeah, we win this one, easy. We actually captured some more. Let's go ahead and... Ah, I want to detach those transports, but it doesn't look like I can. That's fine. So ideally, we will end up getting this. We're actually getting really close to being able... So the problem we're running into is that... We're not able to piece them out uh, separately, or else we were, we're going to lose a lot of war score. So we need to get... Wow. What? Bro, what? They had a better general and everything. Okay, cool. Well, what I was saying is, is we need to get them... We can't piece these guys out separately because we're going to lose a ton of war score. So check this out. Um, Where does it say that? Right over... Is it here? Yeah. Okay, we have 38 against Portugal, actually. So maybe Bengal is actually bringing the war score down. Well, that's an idea. I would like to get some money from them, though. So we're gonna we're gonna go for it. We have the manpower. It's literally not an issue at all. Um, and so these guys are just over here exploring. And um, yeah, I guess I'll piece Bengal out. It, I don't lose anything from doing it, right? Might even get a couple extra money, money in the bank, couple extra ducats. So, as far as our raids, we can raid right now. So, let's go ahead and do that. Um, let's get our Malakan fleet. Where are they at? So, these guys are ready to raid. So, let's go ahead and have you guys up in privateering uh, Sevilla. Whenever you guys are repaired, I want you guys to go raid Sevilla again as well. And then, um, where's this fleet? Where are they at? Here they are. So these guys cannot raid these coasts, but you can raid these ones. So let's go ahead and do that. There we go. We'll just, you know, raid them all. And I'm just watching this army over here, making sure that they aren't getting killed. So Bohemia has some men over here. Oh, nope, that's not what I meant to do. We rule the waves. Wow. Let's see here. 10 prestige for free. Sounds good to me. Go ahead and just destroy his, uh... wow. Oh, and they repair. Well, like, see, that's also really cool. I forgot about that. Okay, so let's go ahead and peace out Bengal. Or I would like to humiliate them, but I guess it's not necessary because we're not, it's probably not necessary. So what is necessary is probably, hmm, I suppose not really. So if I could get Mara, hmm. They can stay friends, that's fine. I'd actually rather just take his money then. Steal his lunch money, you know? Let's go ahead and get you guys over here. This is Russia. Russia, Russia, Russia. Russia's not messing around. All right, cool. Let's go ahead and have you guys go back down and privateer uh, Malacca. And then have you guys disband. These guys are still just going crazy over here. So this is all Portuguese land. We'll be able to concede that later on. Let's go ahead and get you guys over here. Which these guys will immediately get boat bombed and die. So that's wonderful. Very good. So check this out. If they don't get stack wiped immediately, we will allow them to flee. Just kidding. Psych, you shall not flee. And then they die instantly. And just like that, we're good. We have 41 war score. We can take whatever we want, basically. I want like Jamaica, this guy, and this guy. And then Cape Verde. Definitely got to give me that one as well. I would like like basically all of this. Hmm. 
Let's see here. This is important. This one's important because this will allow me to raid all of this, I'm pretty sure. Uh, at least into here. Um, maybe I can worry about these ones later. Those three I definitely want, though. So where's the other ones? So let's go ahead and clear it. This guy. He's Jamaica. This guy, this guy. Cape Verde. And then this guy here. What was bringing up the rest of the score? Oh, that guy right there. That's fine. I'll actually use this to, to demand more in the future. So this is fine. This is totally fine. 57 AE. It's nothing. 7 overextension. And just like that, we have enforced peace on um, Portugal. The number, what? 5 world power below us. And then we actually surpassed 1,000 dev with that. So that's cool. Jamaica is now Japanese. So that's pretty cool. Let's go ahead and core everything up. I'm probably going to end up accepting Portuguese culture. Because we're going to be taking a lot of it. Um, we'll see. Okay. And so with that, I think we're actually going to be eligible... We're not going to need to pay for our fleet basing rights. Oh, it's only two ducats a month? Oh, then I don't care at all. We could actually probably start... Um... So, hmm. I'm just like looking around. So these guys... These guys are privateering. These guys are privateering. Um, privateering. Privateering. These guys should... Ooh. Well, hey, hey, hey. Let's go ahead and raid, raid, raid. Let's see what's going on over here. Screw nine separatists. Lame. There we go. Beautiful. Okay. That's pretty nuts, actually, that we have been able to get so many great concessions from these guys in wars. Um, so what are, where are we looking at? Build manufacturing very good. More free money, production efficiency for 25 years. Sounds good to me. Let's go ahead and build another one. Build some universities over here. Build one in Tsushima. Basically, the sooner we embrace, um, uh, what's it called? Uh, enlightenment, the better, but... We're honestly never going to really get a whole lot of absolutism. These Brunei and Separatists are going to fire one way or the other. Eh, maybe not, actually. Let's just say I wanted to build, like, 10 mercs there. How much would it cost me? 200? 250? How much are we making? One ducat a month? Jeez, oh, Pete. Spoils of War, 29 ducats a month. It's crazy. Very cool. And then in a month, we'll be able to take this tech without penalty, which is cool. Privateers have taken a bunch of money. So let's go ahead and build some mercs over here. Asian Musketeers. Very cool. And uh, basically, I just want to have these guys over here to suppress these rebels. So ideally... We can stop these rebels from firing, which we will. So that's great. And then I'll just get rid of them again. Alright, cool. Let's go ahead and have you guys... Uh, explore over here. And I think I might actually be able to have them... Raid while they're doing it, even? Where are they at right now? Oh, yes. Very cool. Does this say zero ducats? No, thank you. Oh, because you have to have explored it. Right. 1% effectiveness. So yeah, they have 71 guns. Okay, cool. Well, we'll have to send our entire major fleet over there. Let's go ahead and detach you guys and have you guys head over here. Our Caribbean pirating fleet. These Portuguese separatists are almost entirely certainly going to be firing, so... 
Let's go ahead and have you guys go ahead and uh, privateer. And I'm assuming... Mm, yeah, this one might be a good one. Or Ivory Coast. I think Caribbean is probably going to be best. Pirates of the Caribbean, you know? Caribbean, Caribbean. Um, I'll just take the Republican tradition. Very nice. More privateers. Cool, so we can actually put these guys down. So we're not paying for them. How's our army looking? It's so funny how small our army is compared to, like, where we're at on world power stage. Okay. This has been pretty good so far. Um, I think the next thing would be wanting to get all this raided over here. So where's my fleet? There they are. No. Where's my big fleet? Let's go ahead and have you guys come on up there. Uh, no, I don't care about Betsy Misuraka. Oh, cool. We can continue to finish this one out. Heavy ship combat ability is going to be a huge one. Like, that will make invading England so easy, actually. Truce with Sunda is over. That'd be nice. Let's see here. Can we reach? We can reach this stuff. Oh, my gosh. Look at this. Recently been raided by Tunis, I assume. Unfortunate, man. Let's go ahead and privateer Sevilla again. Very cool. Okay, so these guys are all over here. So let's have you guys repair up. Let's see what's going on over here. One percent effective. Uh. Interesting. Even though we have this huge thing, is it... The... Is here? Oh, because we need to wait for our guns to be privateering. Okay, well that's fine. Let's go ahead and have them privateer in uh, the Caribbean and see what that does. Cool. So we can totally just spam this one now. Oh, they're repairing? No, come on now, you weenies. Privateer, um, where is it? Caribbean? Did I not say Privateer Caribbean? Where'd those rebels pop? Australia. Eh, I don't care if you're Catholic. You can be Catholic, man. That doesn't bother me. I'm a tolerant dude. How's conversions been? So just a little bit of Shinto over here in Sri Lanka. That's pretty cool, man. A little bit of Shinto over here. A little bit of Shinto out here. We're working our way through it, you know. It's a work in progress. Get some admin points spent over here. For some reason, these guys will not privateer. Um, Caribbean. Here we go. 99%. Nice. Diplotech cost sounds good to me. And they are not privateering anymore. Is there a bug? Excuse me? Very good. Nice. Very nice. Perfect. That is wonderful. Alright, cool. So as far as forts goes, where do we want forts at? I'd like to upgrade this fort here. These guys here. These guys here. And, and so this is mostly for army tradition. Because my army tradition is garbage. And if I would just have some forts, I would actually be gaining army tradition. Sipping some coffee, by the way. Saklava. So we can go ahead and state up some of this stuff over here. Southern Madagascar. Oh, if I if I didn't want to state it, I could trade company it. 
But I feel like trade company doesn't make much sense because this is... Yeah, I feel like it makes more, more sense to actually... I think it makes more sense to uh, state it ourselves. Uh, Greater Antilles. Where's that? Greater Antilles. Where is the Greater Antilles? I actually don't know. The Jamaica? Ah, very nice. Oh, Jamaica 17 dev. No wonder I got so much AE for that. Cool. Our general died, unfortunate. Oh my gosh, these fleets that we're raiding. I didn't get any money from that though, that's weird. Hmm. More privateer money, but we're not actually getting it, so I don't really know how that works. We're gonna get more war galleons. He's old, so we're gonna go ahead and go with a new dude who is young. Quite good. He's an expansionist. We have a colonist. I don't really know where I'm gonna be using them. Admittedly, I'm kind of considering, I'm on the fence of just ditching this and going with like a new group that's gonna be more useful. Um, I don't really know which one would be. Maybe like a... Another mill group, honestly, would be best, but the heavy ship combat ability is going to be huge. Let's go ahead and get you guys, um, these guys need to get upgraded here as soon as we get this. Um, so these guys are ready to expand up here. Knowledge is power indeed, but I will lose that because I don't want to have rebels. Rebels give me butt cancer, and I don't want that, so. These guys are not protecting trade. Where are they at? I don't know why you guys are here. Let's go ahead and have you guys go privateer. Hmm. Caramendel? No, it's pretty poor. How much is in Gujarat? We're taking a lot of money from the French over there. I really think that the Cape of, or the Ivory Coast is gonna be a good one. Let's go ahead and privateer in uh, the Caribbean and see what this is actually doing for us. Really? Oh, oh, hey. 20 years of Fort Defense National Tax Modifier National Unrest or some... No, I don't care. I'm not going to pay for that. Let them eat cake. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Our philosopher is dad. Uh, is this a philosopher? He's a theologian. He'd be useful right now, but I think we're going to go with... Hmm... Yeah, let's go with him. That's fine, actually. We could totally upgrade him as well. Yeah. So much for that. Our privateers are just crushing these fleets. Cool. So let's go ahead and have you guys hang out over here. Upgrade our heavies is going to be super important. Um... So we need one of these fleets over here. I thought that I had told these guys... Cape of Good Hope. Are we getting anything from that? Nope, because they are not actually privateering it. Let's go ahead and have you guys privateer the Caribbean. Let's have you guys go ahead and privateer the Caribbean. Why am I, like, blind? I just can't see it. There it is. Let's go ahead and get another set of pirate ships up and ready to roll here within the year. And um, let's go ahead and convert some land, eh? Oh, no, no, that's a lot of money. Let's go with something like that. Stab or prestige? Well, I'm going to go with stab, but the discipline is crazy good. Let's take a look at our army quality compared to everything. So we're not that high on morale, but discipline, we're pretty good. 
What's our mill guy? So he's a discipline guy as well. Interesting. Very interesting. Shun is up there with the Timurids. Interesting, interesting, interesting. So, I'm thinking if we wanted to, we could get a claim on these guys over here. So let's go ahead and get a claim on Friesland. What's his ally alliance network look like? Commonwealth is the emperor? No way. That's so funny. He would defend him, and that would call in Spain and Venice and... He's OP, man. All right, cool. We'll figure this out in the next one. So um, we've definitely extended our our reach here. Um, let's actually go ahead and see what it's looking like down in, in Mexico, what, what the raids would look like down here. Pretty good. So we're going to run on over this way. 35 ducats, not bad. Okay, not bad. I, w I would really like to get over here, but I don't think we're going to be able to reach down there. 28 ducats, not bad. And I don't think we can reach down here. Yeah, unfortunate. Well, that's okay. So, I hope you guys are enjoying. And if you are, please show your support and leave a like on the video. It helps other people find the channel. It helps with the YouTube algorithm. So, I appreciate the support. Um, also, if you want to subscribe, don't forget to do that. Uh, a lot of my viewers aren't subscribers. So, if you like what I do, go ahead and subscribe. And you'll see what I'm doing every day. And uh, if you want to check out the Discord or support the channel via our Patreon page, the links for both of those are going to be in the description below the video. And with all that being said, this is Chewy Shoot, and I'll catch you guys later. A big special thanks to Bloodbound92, Valentel, CWG, Dutch Terror, J Clampett, Yudaldo, Classified for Life, Corbett Gaming, Michael Walker, Palmer, Jonathan Crane, Airborne Animal, and all my other awesome supporters on Patreon. I appreciate you guys. Check out the two series linked on the left and the right, and don't forget to subscribe.